Representative Roberts. Thank you. Uh, I, my email has been slammed with people who oppose this legislation. This takes away rights from people who have never even been convicted. I don't see how that's right. And not only that, it makes it very difficult for them to get their rights back. They have to go through a lot of red tape. It is not fair. Most of these people, or not most, I'm not going to say most, I can't speak for most, but a lot of them, it will affect the poor, and how are they supposed to afford a lawyer? That's who it's going to affect. It's not fair. So, actually, there are, there are actually many uh, laws in place right now to stop convicted felons from getting arms in their hands, getting firearms in the, into their hands. So the laws are sufficient. We just need to enforce them. We don't need to make more. It's not that any of us agree with domestic violence, but we shouldn't make the innocent pay for that which th these felons are doing. Maybe we just made it, need to make our laws tougher. Those people who are felons, keep them in jail longer. Why should the innocent people suffer? It's not right. That's all I want to say. Oh, actually, one more thing. Now, people can also, if you get some crazy person who really wants to kill someone and they don't have a gun, guess what? They're going to find another means to do that. They'll hit them with a car if they have to. And what are we going to do? Are we going to outlaw cars? That'd be ridiculous. I urge you to vote against this bill. Thank you.